Welcome back, my fuzzy frugal watchers. I'm frugal, and you're fuzzy, and you're watching me play games, especially Dead Space. If you've clicked on this video, this is part three. If you haven't seen the previous two parts, which you should have checked those out, because what are you doing here? What are you doing? But anyways, like and subscribe anyway. Ha, you can watch whatever video you want. This is, this is, it is what it is. So here we are, Dead Space. I just used the, what's it called? The thermite or whatever to do that deal. It's been a few days. Since I've played, so I might be a wee bit rusty, but we're just going to continue on our way, and let's get to it. Uh... Okay, you're through. Should be clear from there to the morgue. Remember, the codes are on the captain's body. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan transmitting ship-wide. We need more help. We don't have the resources to deal with this many cases. Nobody would tell us what's happening. These wounds, we are not equipped to deal with this. God. Get him to the table. Hold him. Not you hold him down. Every quarter. That was Nicole, right? I can't tell from here when that log was made. I'm sure she's around here somewhere. Yeah. Nasty hole. Let's see. Okay. Ooh, yeah. Gotta play us some dead space. Spooky, spooky. Snappy. Snip, snappy. All right, ammo. Oh, just so you guys know, let's look at our inventory. We've got two small heels, which is not great, but it's something. And it looks like I'm okay on ammo for now. We got one stasis pack. Not too bad, and I've got a medium air can. So, all in all, we're doing okay. I probably should have started this game on medium, which is what I beat it on last time. I just thought for uh, content's sake I would try it on the hardest difficulty, even though I've never played it on hard. Which isn't a great idea for... Yeah, this, I'm I'm better at uh, first person shooters. It's always been hard with me on with a controller to play shooter games. Um, I don't like to make excuses, but that's my excuse. Yeah, I stink with a controller. And just to cover my butt in the future, I stink with mouse and keyboard too. Probably, I don't know. I'm not gonna claim to be some epic gamer that's awesome at everything. Get off my back! Sorry, I didn't mean to yell at you. I love you. <laughs> anyway, monsters. I like monsters. Oh, yeah, battery. Uh, where's battery at? <laughs> Where is battery at? And... Okay. Oh, there he is. I think it's this button. Yeah, there we go. Assuming that's the correct way to go. Is there any other side rooms to go through? Already went in there. Ooh. Line racks, I can sell that for some dough. I like some money. Oh, there's a stompy pack. Stompy. Thousand dollars. Knock over all this stuff. Oops. Oops, sorry. Oops. Oops, sorry. 
All right, let's proceed. Whoops. Almost terrible. I thought I was gonna die. <laughs> this game is this game's awesome. Man, that was hard. Power lock enabled. Ooh. Do I use the node? No. I need that to level my gun. I noticed on uh, when I upgraded my weapons, I saw I didn't add anything into damage. I was watching back to footage. I was like, whoops. So that was unfortunate. I need to upgrade my damage. Hello? Can anybody hear me? My name is Eileen Fisk. I just woke up in here and everybody was gone. I don't know what's happening. Why do they all leave? I'm going to try and find someone. If you can hear this, please come for me. I can hear scratching in the wall. Hello? Who's there? Are, are you a doctor? Why is everyone... Wait, I know you. You're Harris, the prisoner from the colony. You killed that nurse. Help! Somebody help me! Please! Please! She'll be fine. Okay, that's where I need to go. So I'm gonna go this way. I see flashy things. I like loot. Sometimes loot comes with monsters. Oh, God. Yeah, three of them? Have a nice day. This game's brutal, man. Have a nice day. You too. That's nice. Enjoy. There we go. Too many mountains. I don't like games that have too many mountains. Oh. Uh, yes, more ammo, please. How are we looking? All right, two heals. Okay, okay. Uh, that's not bad. Uh, decent amount of ammo. Obviously, I've burned through some, but that's all right. To be expected. My shots have been better. Still not great. This game's freaky. Ugh. Doing in there. Ow. Oh, 
It'll be fine. Just a flesh wound. Pictures. The pictures. Doesn't look totally human. Science log from Dr. Kine, Chief Science Officer. Attention, Captain Matthias B. Benjamin. Further to our previous conversation, I asked that you delay bringing the marker. Whoops. I don't know. I, my bad. How does one pull back up? I think that's precisely the point, Doctor. God's work. I'm not so sure of that. We have to assume that the colony's problems are somehow connected to the marker. You can assume all you want to. I do not. The marker is glorious and divine. You... you know that. God moves in mysterious ways. Anyway, we'll have it on board tomorrow. You can analyze it all you want to. What are you so worried about? Worried? Captain, people are dying down there, killing each other. Is this madness, the transformation unitology teaches us? Doctor, Terrence, there will always be risk when the stakes are high. And here, they're enormous. It could change everything. The stakes better be delicious. And that's what worries me. I think we've seen that before. I, I don't know how to get back to that bit. Oh, look, I can save. Yes, please. I'd like to save. Uh-huh. Science Blog, Chief Science Officer Dr. Kine reporting. The colony's problems concern me greatly. I have no doubt they are somehow linked to the discovery of the marker. But the exact nature of that connection is still unknown. Almost 40% of the colonists are experiencing a form of dementia. The obvious symptoms are acute depression, insomnia, and hallucination. Incidents of violence and even murder also indicate extreme paranoia. Dr. Mercer has advised that I bring some of the affected on board for study. Dr. Wellen, the planet-side psychiatrist, has reported that his own analysis has been fruitless. I'm hesitant to rely on Dr. Mercer at this point. But I need his expertise. We need solutions, and we need them quickly. Okle dokle. That's the kind of place I want to go to during all this. I guess they're not zombies, right? They're mutants. Received 
and they look good. Thank God. I'll start accessing the captain's records right now. Head to the tram station, and I'll contact you there. I'm going to find out what the hell happened to this ship. It wasn't good, I'll tell you that. Hey, a thousand dollars. Hey, mid pack. Power node. And that was. Bad monster. Bad. How dare you make weird zombie men? Bad monsters. I mush him around to assert dominance. See if there's some more monsters. Hey, monsters. Very spooky monsters. There's a spooky monster. Don't worry, cut off his legs and arms. And any more damage. This is ridiculous. These guys are stupid. They're gonna give me like a thousand ammo. Yeah, I'll take six. It takes like 18 to kill one of you dudes. Ah, my ammo. My ammo ain't looking so good anymore. Isaac! Somehow one of them found a way down to the captain's nest. I managed to contain it in a damaged escape pod. Lifting executive lockdown now. I found the deck logs. Whatever is happening around here, it came from the planet when they cracked it open. It spread to the colony and reached the ship. Isaac, this isn't an infection. It's some form of alien life. <laughs> Shit, we've got bigger problems. The ship's engines are offline and our orbit is decaying. Get over to the engineering deck ASAP while I stay here and figure out what the problem is. Local dope. I hope there's spooky moochies. Wish I could do a little farming. I'd like to farm for some ammo and credits. Me. Let me go store first. Let's buy some stuff. I clearly need. What do we got? 11. Okay. I, I would like to buy a power node, but. Um, I'll have to forego that for ammo right now. I want the power node, but. I'm kind of in a bad spot. I guess I could sell the line racks. Let's do that. Uh, I'll keep the stasis pack. I can actually use the stasis pack, but I'm afraid that's when I'll find a recharge. That'd make me mad. I'll use it and then immediately find a recharge. Alright. So I still got some ammo. Or money, I mean. Still got plenty of money. So in case I need more ammo, I can do that. Back to the tram. Yeah, that's right. End the level.
Can't wait to try out the uh, remake. You've got two problems, and we're working on borrowed time here. First, there's no fuel in the engines. Second, the gravity centrifuge is offline, which means there's a couple of trillion tons of rock pulling us down. I need you to get that centrifuge operational. Refuel the main engine and fire it up so I can stabilize the ship's orbit. Okay. P.S. Watch out for bangers. They're spooky. Monsters be monsters. Alright. Into the gates of hell we march. Okay, so we got a store here. Another save spot. money can I play the thing what is that what is Sun is it, is, oh there are cans of some kind of drink okay gotcha soda and we need more Sun that must be a very popular beverage and uh, okay so that's that's the way to go that's the way I came and this is a direction uh, oh, yeah, okay. So I'll probably have to come back, I think. Okay. Well, at any rate, I'm going to save here. And call this an episode. I might might be a little short, but I think this is a pretty good place to call this one. I don't want episodes to run too long, but sometimes they do, and that's cool. Uh, I try to keep them around 30 minutes, but a lot of times they go over. This one may be a little bit shorter, but still not bad. Um, but anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Take care.